Hey friends, welcome back. Today is going to be a bit of a vlog. It is the week before Mother's Day. I'm going to be taking my mom on a date, and so I thought it would be a little bit more fun to do it vlog style. If you don't remember, last year for Mother's Day, we did a little video together, and I will link that in the cards above, and you can check that out. It was really fun to re-watch that with her. Once again, uh, we are going to be doing a collaboration with Anna Luisa for Mother's Day. They love my mom, apparently, and wanted to gift her some jewelry. <laughs> But I also got myself something here, which you can see. These earrings are freaking dope. I am in love with them. Oh my gosh. Thank you, Anna Luisa. And then I'm wearing some jewelry from past collaborations with them. And I'm going to go to her house. We're going to style a little outfit. And then we're going to go to one of my favorite restaurants and her favorite restaurants in Knoxville, which is called The French Market. So... <laughs> going to be a very French girl, French lady, French woman inspired vlog. Oh yeah, and before I forget, there is 15% off of Anna Luisa's jewelry from now until past Mother's Day, so you definitely want to snag yourself some jewelry, snag your mom, your best girlfriend, your auntie, your mentor, yourself again. Uh, get yourself some jewelry for Mother's Day. Use the discount link in the description box below. What I love about them is that they are a sustainable and ethical company. They really use high quality noble metals. They use recycled metals, gold and silver. And I love them because they don't upset or irritate my skin. They're committed to being 100% emissions, carbon emissions free. They use recycled materials and they pretty much try to maintain their quality standards without jacking up the prices. So everything starts at $39 on the website, but they do have really higher end luxury pieces, which I highly recommend looking at. Yeah, you know I've worked with them many 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 times and I'm just really grateful for them and I'm grateful to continue to share a sustainable jewelry brand with you guys and because they're so 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 cute I love these earrings I have never owned anything like these before in my life so and I can't wait to show you what I got my mom anyways I hope she likes it <laughs> Let's go to my mom's house and then we'll go to the French market together and it'll be a really fun mom-daughter date. So let's go. Let's come along. Come along for the ride. Okie dokie. I made it. I made it. I'm at mom's. It's a beautiful drive to my mom's house. I love spring. Tennessee in the spring. Oh my gosh, so beautiful. Let's go inside and see mom and we'll talk about fashion and makeup and heirlooms and stuff like that. Hey! Hi. So good to see good you. To see you too. Come on in. Yay! I'm so glad to be here. Happy pre Mother's Day. Oh, I'm so excited Happy about Mother's this. Day. Let's go into so your bedroom. Um, I'm so glad you're willing to help style today because I'm really struggling Ooh. with what to wear. Oh, really? Yeah. So. Oh, let me flip around. Okay. Well, come here and say hi. Okay. Come here and say hi. 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 Hey, hi. <laughs> welcome. Welcome, welcome. Welcome, welcome. I'm so excited. Yes, yes. Mom, this is going to be so much fun. Your bedroom is so cute, by the way. Oh, thank Look you. Look at your pretty little things hanging up. How pretty. So you're not sure about these? No. I'm trying to not just wear black and white all the time. Oh, I love these pictures. <gasps> so oh. this is Grandma, right? Yeah, that's my mom, my twin brothers. And then that's you. That's little me, yes. Oh. My older sister Bonnie. Oh my gosh, little baby Hope. Grandma was so stylish. Wasn't she? Oh, and then here she is on her wedding day. I think that's 51. Look 1951. 1951. Mm-hmm. <gasps> And then look at you. Oh, yes. <laughs> what Red, a total yeah. babe you were. Red-headed hope. That's probably no, 90. No, that's 90s. Yeah, yeah 90 91. Yeah. Or 92. No, I know that's 92 for a fact because okay. we were in Florida. Okay. And then here's uh, your... My dad's parents when they got married, and that was March 11, uh, 1919. Oh, wow. And then um, me... Shopping is... for my wedding dress. Yes. And then you and Colin. Yeah, a little kissy kiss. I also love your ficus. You've had this oh. for so long, right? I've what? I've had that like since... Uh, 25 years? Oh, maybe more? Let me think. Humongous. 25, but... 20, maybe. Okay, yeah. let's look at your pretty... Okay. Your pretty clothes. Oh, okay. let me see here. Oh my gosh. Look at all how how organized she is. Yes, with a little so help from organized from a daughter. Well, I try. Yes. I try. I'm loving your boots. Oh, thank you. Just 
things you collect along the way and never get rid of. Oh my gosh, and your clogs. My clogs, which you have a couple of pairs, right? I just have one. Oh. And then we both have this jacket from Old Navy. That's right. And then, look at it. Now these are a vintage pair of, oh. of uh, leather. Oh my gosh. Pumps. Yeah. Oh, not super, super old, probably from the 60s. 60s, yeah. I love this sheer scarf. It's so beautiful. Do you still have the, the blue one that you got like that? I don't think so, no. Okay. I think I got rid of it. Okay. Okay, so talk me through what you're wearing. Um, These are just a simple cotton black and white stripe. And your little house shoesies? And my little house shoesies. Oh, and so a little cute. cotton you know, chemise on the top and a linen, little linen thing. Little so cute. Jacket on top. I think we should take a peek at your your heirloom stuff. Okay. Your heirloom stuff that you want to show us. Okay. So um, the sandals. Do you want to look at yes, the sandals? Yes, first? yes, yes, yes. You talked about those in a video. I did. Ooh. Yeah, these are them. Oh, they're so beautiful. And um, and they're still in pretty good shape. Um, as you can see, they're all leather heel sole, rather. Oh my gosh. And the fabric is so soft. The buckskin, I think. DKNY. Mm -hmm. And where did you get these? I think I picked them up at a TJ Maxx in Houston. And then you've had these since the 90s, right? I think so. It, so it seems good. like they've been with me for a long time. The other thing I wanted to show you, maybe, I don't know if these would, because <gasps> I thought maybe you were going to bring the Jay Peterman bag. Ooh, I did And didn't. we were going to talk about that. Oh, I should have, though. Yeah. You know what else I remembered is, I remembered the, sorry, what brand are these? Hugo, Hugo Biscotti. Hugo Biscotti. Yeah. Okay, we need to talk about this for a second. Okay. Okay, Hugo Biscotti is one of those brands. So it's one of those brands that <laughs> Hi. Hi. So it's one of those brands that I just commented on YouTube today that someone was asking like what are some pre-loved blazer brands mm -hmm. that you recommend? Some of the best thrift store blazers I've ever found in like super cute white 2K styles or early 2000s styles. Hugo Biscotti. I so love it. You've been hanging on to these for so long. I have. Mom, I love them. Thank you. I think you could wear these today if you yeah. wanted to. Like if you want, if we restyled you a little bit. Okay. All right. Oh, and then I'm wearing your jacket. Oh, right. So I get tons of compliments on this. Yeah, this is from high school. No. This is actually the year out of high school. But Wait. I, yeah, but I can't, yeah, I was thinking back about it. Are you serious? Yeah, because you, here's another thing that's going to blow no your way. mind. Okay. It was actually your dad's. It was actually your dad, Stop. and he gave it to me. <gasps> yep. Oh my God. Yeah. It was. Yep. Stop it. Yeah, I started really thinking <gasps> back about it when someone had asked you what style it was. Yes. So wait, this is from the seventies. Right. This is late seventies. Yeah, late seventies. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm I'm freaking late out 70s. right now. Yeah. I'm freaking. Yeah. Oh, whoa, whoa, what? Yeah. Okay, I'm freaking yeah. out right now. Yeah. Okay, you were yeah. thinking about maybe changing? Yes. Let's see. I would say, oh, that's a tough call because I love the linen. Yeah, they're, they're just super comfy, you know, like yes. it's a little warmer out today. It really is. I'm yeah. overdressed. But we'll be inside mostly. Yeah. I'm thinking jeans, jeans, Should I just go jeans? and mm -hmm. either your ballet flats sandals or your superga tennies oh i love to, that to like kind of match the to do the the linen yeah okay change okay I they're these they're light blue yeah and i can still keep the black top yeah. and the white okay of course okay and again this is where brianna's knowledge is so awesome because these kind of things are not always understood by sure older folk well you know <laughs> You and you inspired my style, obviously, in like how you care for clothes, and I can't wait to. I don't know. I can't wait to see. Okay. 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 Let me let you change. Well, we got you in your your cut off denims. So cute, showing off your your beautiful ankles and toes, toesies. <laughs> and then you're wearing this beautiful joie silk. Joie silk. I want to show people the print. That is so pretty to me. It is. It's a beautiful print. It looks so great on you, and it's your. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that, that's my sister. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I think it's cute. Yeah. And, I mean, they're like oversized boyfriend jeans, which yep. are adorable. Yeah. What happens if you pair them with these awesome... 
mules. Mules. These woven mules. Let's see what these puppies look like with it. Okay. Adorable. Yeah, is it? Yeah, strike a pose. <gasps> oh. Ta-da. Ta-da. <laughs> <laughs> Oh yeah, that's that's cute. Okay. Oh, okay. I like you just... that. Okay. Well, how do you feel? Do you? It's very comfortable. It's a very comfortable outfit. Okay. So. I love it. Yeah. Yeah, I feel like we are also okay. kind of twinning a little bit. We are. Yes. Something else that I just remembered that I don't want to forget is to show this beautiful piece that your sister made. Yes. She made this for me in um, nineteen. Uh, 92 or 3 and we had just come back from Germany and I had from walking everywhere climbing right. steps everywhere and it fit me oh like a glove so beautiful as you can see she's very talented has got a two-tone linen pattern here truly so talented yes and she made that necklace, that pearl necklace I was wearing in my last video. Yes. The straw bags. Yes. Oh, it's so, so beautiful. So she actually made that for you, like custom. Yes. That's gorgeous. And she, and she's just gone nowhere but up from there. I mean, she's With her a talent very, level. very talented woman. She, yeah. Should we show people the bag that she made? The leather one? Yes. Yeah, sure. Oh my gosh. Okay. Yeah, let me go get it. Okay. While you're getting that, I want to show people this picture that I took of you. This is my mom in like 1999. Pretty sure I was in ninth grade when I took these. And they were for my very first photography project. Isn't she gorgeous? I don't want to show you guys this one because it's, it's my favorite. Isn't that neat? I was like, Mom, do something different and crazy so I can be an artist. I love that. Love those. Okay, so here's the bag that my aunt made. She bought the leather from a local leather store and, and cut it out based on her own ideas. Stitched it all by hand. Oh my gosh. All of this is by hand. She's amazing. And then made this little clutch. To go inside. To go inside. What a handy person. Yes. I'm like, my mind is blown right now. Yeah, just major, major, major talent. Oh, and then that's there's so neat. a little pocket in the back <gasps> as well. Ain't she talented? Yeah. I love this hardware. Yeah. It's like, wow. So cool. Isn't that great? So great. Are you hungies? I am hungies. I'm Are so we going, hungry. We're going to munch. We're going to go to the <gasps> French market. Yay! For a mommy daughter French date. French market. Sweet. Yay. illustrious career on YouTube. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> oh my gosh. This is exciting. Okay. You don't have to keep them if you don't like them, but you they're all for you. Oh wow. They're all for you. Oh my gosh. Okay. <gasps> don't you just love stuff like this? I love stuff like this. Well, can I just open them? Like, open them really quickly yes. now? Okay. I'm going to double record you. Oh. <gasps> paper clips with diamonds and then yes I love it I can't believe I'm getting three wow lucky me oh oh and a gorgeous gold here, me, here let me do this for your camera oh oh, oh. Wow. so pretty how pretty 
Yay! And then, my gosh. Oh, Brianna. Oh, And that goes so nice with the one I wear quite often. You know, the one you got me yes. a couple of Christmases ago. Oh, yeah. This is fantastic. Thank you. You're so welcome, Mom. This is so beautiful. I love it. We should do... I think we should get the... the <laughs> Kiddo, you are just the sweetest. You, you sweet girl. I love you. I love you too. <laughs> this is adorable. Thank you. Totally works. I'm kind of curious to know, like, who your biggest style influences were. My mom, for sure, because mm -hmm. she had a really unique style. I think you captured that photo of her, you know, and that was kind of her look all the really? time. My mom, so some of the actresses, obviously, growing up that were uh, just such icons. You know, Katherine Hepburn, although she's, you know, kind of like a little older than my mom, I think. Right. Lauren Bacall, Sophia mm -hmm. Loren, you know, my sort of, uh, you know, person that I fashion after. Diane. Diane. What's one piece of style advice you would give to your younger self? Younger self, um, starting out, don't try to dress like the model in the magazine. Oh. And all the different trends. Try to dress with the things that work with your shape, with your color. You know, not everything that's on the runway is going to fit your body or your body type, whatever. That is so true. That doesn't always work out, but that's okay. You find your own way, and before you know it, you find your own style. That's true. <laughs> so my mom influenced me. Is it possible I have influenced you too? And Oh my gosh, without a doubt. Yeah. And without well, a doubt. What would you say is like your the number one thing that stands out? You always taught me to play, play dress up, mm -hmm. and you taught me that it was okay to be myself and to be an outfit repeater and yes. to even have some really awkward times fashion-wise and life-wise because it's okay, it's okay to fail and experiment. And but I do remember so early on, you know, um, being drawn to clothing and you recognizing that mm -hmm. and you encouraging that and um, not not getting mad at me because I wanted to wear the same pink princess <laughs> dress like <laughs> like literally it would come off you to get washed and you'd put it right back on that's hilarious as soon as it was out of the dryer so definitely play and then as I got older and started understanding fashion and some of this stuff I didn't realize until I was, you know, much older. But you always took such good care of your clothes. You literally would get it dry clean. I remember going to the dry cleaner. You would hand wash it. Yep. You never dried things in the dryer that were nice clothes. Yep. And I think you got that from Grandma because she was Depression era. Like, if you had this piece of clothing, you completely mm -hmm. took care of it. She definitely mm -hmm. had that influence in her life, and then that gets passed along, you know. One of her favorite expressions, and I think you remember this, is that mm -hmm. she would say, when we were very young, uh, we did not have a lot of money. My dad yeah. was um, going to seminary. Not a lot of money, and she said that we were too poor to buy cheap. For the longest time, I wasn't really sure what that meant. Really? Until I was a little bit older, and you, you see about money going for yes. this product or that product and how quickly you have to replace that product. Especially now with fast fashion, I kind of feel like, although I still buy fast fashion things, I definitely notice that if it is a really low quality piece, it wears out so quickly. Mm -hmm. It's like, what's the point of even having purchased it if it's going to get misshapen or if it's going to, you know, become threadbare or the threads are going to fall out or it has coarse, you know, construction. Uh, but I do love those little stories of when you were really young, I beginning to identify your style. Do you remember the blue jean skirt and the cowboy blue boots that were blue jeans? Without a doubt. <laughs> 
<laughs> Without a doubt. And you styled that so beautifully. <laughs> I haven't changed at all, I guess. <laughs> denim. Denim. You were into denim. Really early on. Really early on. And you wore a, an adorable little pink shirt with it. I don't know if you remember that. Mm -hmm. Yep. And a little headband. Mm. Mm -hmm. Lunch is done. Lunch is done. Lunch is done. And we're packing it up. We Yay. have to go our separate ways. Meow. Oh well. <laughs> You've got these but beautiful it's been, earrings. I know. It's been so fun, so oh. wonderful. I love just hanging out with my daughter. You know, it doesn't yeah. matter what we do. I know. I, I love hanging out with you too, Mom. And thanks to Anna Luisa yes. again for sponsoring today's video. You can get 15% off using the link in the description box below. Mom, do you want to be a YouTuber? Say, check the link in the description box below. Take the link in the prescription box <laughs> below. In the prescription box below. That's fitting. In the prescription box below. <laughs> Let's try that again. Check <laughs> the link in the subscription box below. In the description box. <laughs> I love you. You're so cute. No, I'm not going to be a YouTuber. No, never. <laughs> But kind of, occasionally. Yeah, the occasional yeah. YouTuber. Awesome. Well, thank you guys so much. Say goodbye to Mom. Wish Bye her guys. a happy Mother's Day in the comments section below. Aw, sweet. Happy Mother's Day to everyone out there. We love you.